Right side means walk on the right side of the hallway. Walking on the right side of the hallway helps us get to class faster. There's too many kids to be walking on both sides of the hall. It would be a mess. It would be a mess, a big mess. Think of the hallway like a road. Just like every car needs to stay on its side, every student should stay on their side. Walking on the right keeps you from bumping into each other when you're turning the corner. Oh, oh hey! hey. <laughs> it's important to walk on the right side. Do not run. Walk very quickly so you can get to your class on time. Before the bell rings. <laughs> Walking on the right side helps you obey rules and so Right place. Go straight to your next class. Take the shortest route possible to your next class. Talk to your friends as you're walking. Don't stop in the middle of the hallway. When you stop in the middle of the hallway, it blocks to other people. You should always be moving to your next class. Don't stop to visit other teachers. Only go to your next assigned class. You may need to use the restroom, but you still have to make it to class on time. The right place will helps you accept responsibility and so on. Right mindset. Your goal is to get to your next class without any issues. Keep your hands sweet and unkind words to yourself. Hands to yourself means don't touch other people. This includes horseplay such as slapping and public displays of affection such as hugging. Feet to yourself means no kicking or tripping others. Be kind in the hallways. Yes, you can talk, but it is unkind to yell or make other loud noises in the hallway. It's also unkind to engage in gossip or spread rumors. If you hear or see anything suspicious, Avoid it and report it. Remember, your goal is to get to your next class without any issues. The right mindset closely relates to show respect and rise to excellence, parts of sore.